you're a frequent traveler, I do suggest that you splurge and go to the Sky Club. And it actually saves you a lot of money when you pay for it monthly. You come in here, you get food, you get drinks, and it's all included. We're right here at the Sky Club, courtesy of Nicole. We're gonna drink our breakfast this morning, apparently. What are we ordering? Your mimosa looks so pretty, I'm kinda jealous. But I like my double jacket and coke. So this is where they have breakfast. You can get your Starbucks coffee. I see pineapples, yogurt, bananas, bread. No problem. I see bagels. So we're getting breakfast. Gonna get this omelet, Miss Sheila done made. What else we got over We got potatoes. Okay. That pepper or salt. Condiments for the eggs. We got some shredded cheese, bacon bits. Chive cream cheese. What's this? Chocolate chip cream cheese. Plain cream cheese. Would it be fat to try chocolate chip cream cheese? No? Okay. Yesenia, I'm slightly feeling the jack already. The two sips I had. <laughs> Pineapple, yogurt, bananas. I'm feeling good. Roatan, Honduras, also known as the Big Island, is one of Honduras's Caribbean Bay Islands. Roatan is part of the huge Mesoamerican Barrier Reef, making this location a prime spot for dive sites, marine life, and pristine beaches. During the downtime, the island is great for rest and relaxation. Roatan is a hot spot for cruises sailing through Central America to dock. The island comes live on cruise days. All of the vendors come out. These are the only days to get the best souvenirs at an affordable price. If you miss it, the airport has a few gift shops with overpriced trinkets. Ever wanted to experience staying on your own private island surrounded by nature and wildlife? That is what I wanted to experience on this trip. My first stop was at the Little French Key. It is a small island off of Roatan, accessible only by boat. Little French Key is mostly known for the animal encounter interactions that is plastered all over Instagram. Sadly, they do not offer the jaguar encounters anymore, but they still have plenty to do. Kaden, so they were born in captivity. And they used to live with uh, the owner. I stayed in the newly remodeled honeymoon suite. All booking correspondence was handled by Carla, the administrator, through the Little French Key website. Once we got there, she personally took care of us and any request that we had. Our stay of three days and two nights cost us $623.60. This is USD, including the extra person fee of $50 a night. I have a full whole to review on my Instagram page, Talisa and the Traveling Trio. There are countless photo opportunities all over the island. We paid extra for add-on services, such as a guided snorkel tour to the Barrier Reef for $20 per person, and a horseback swim for $25 per person. Those prices cannot be beat anywhere. Speed stones, light fixture, the sink. This is a towel rack. I folded the towels and put them there. Little stands. Then you have your basic toilet. They do provide conditioner and shampoo for you. Other than that, it was a cute Happy birthday, to Lisa. Thank you, Holly. You're like the greatest yet worst bartender ever. <laughs> Thank you. I appreciate that. <laughs> <laughs> I really yeah. love it. Oh, the <laughs> oh my gosh. We are on a private island by ourselves. The entire staff has left. There's no one here. We are left with the lions, tigers, jaguars. We got Louie the dog to protect Louis us. Louie to leave. Louis needs I don't know why she's hating on Louie. Louie's sweet. He a little roo-roo like where we gonna have to save. 
I don't think y'all understand how creepy this shit is. Like, when you're on a private island, when you are on a private island, but y'all know black people don't do horror films, so this is some, this some creepy shit. Like, we on this island shit. by ourselves. Like, Real horror movie shit. everybody don't fucking left us. There's not even a peak. Nothing. <laughs> Just the macaws, the lions, the tigers, the bears, the jaguars, and shit. Like, pray for us, y'all. Nicole, you you that friend? You can't even open the fucking door. Nicole, who in the room? What? Who that in the room? Who in the room? Nicole. When you wake up in paradise, we had this entire island to ourselves last night. It's beautiful. It's one of the bars. Things called the Rasta Monkey Bar. This is part of the private installations for VIP only. This is the barge. They have a boat that takes us back and forth across to the other side. It's part of the VIP installations. We also get access to this. Girl, you about to fall in that water? Because you want to go on the swing? Look at you. You all right? No, I wasn't going to fall in the water. I should have slipped in. Terrible. That was a nice little sidebar. So it's like a nice little lounge area for us to hang out. They have the massage table set up up here. Get a massage while I'm looking at the ocean. Beautiful view. Just get you to sit out here and enjoy it. There goes the Rasta Monkey Bar. Harlan, the bartender, is freaking amazing. He makes some of the best drinks. Little French Key offers a variety of activity packages for those that choose not to stay on the island. The most popular is the VIP Adventure Package for $198 USD per person. This includes transportation, entry to the island, animal rescue center, guided snorkel tour, six well drinks, private area with a waiter, horseback swimming adventure, a 20-minute massage, a locker, food, use of the snorkel gear, kayaks, and paddle boards. To make up for no longer having the Jaguar interaction, they do give you the option of a banana boat experience, 20 minutes of a flyboard or a jet ski. As you can see, it was cost effective for us to stay at the Little French Key and get all of this access and just pay extra for the activities that we actually wanted to do. Just some of the grounds. We're about to walk to the other side. Yesenia and I are gonna jump. Right, Yesenia? Punk. So they're building more bars back here. More enclosures for animals. Things over this way, we gotta go. They're adding more things here. So it's still a work in progress, but it's still a fun place to go. They have some swings all over the grounds. This is the back part. They have two swing ropes, so that's where we're gonna jump from. More of an animal sanctuary. I didn't even know they had these guys back here. You want to talk? Okay. Bye, guys. Mm. 
is one way to get to see the island on the back of a horse. Are we going to the water? Okay. Ooh. Water's warm. Oh my lord. Oh, okay. Oh, that's awesome. Oh. <laughs> In the water, that's great. <laughs> Hi, Nicole. Mine is already acting up, so I just want to be very quiet. I got pictures of y'all, but I can't get a picture of you. Either one's fine. There goes my horse. I'm not on my horse anymore. My horse fell in a hole. I jumped the fuck off. So I don't know if my horse has fell in a hole, whatever the fuck just happened as we were walking in the water. Yeah, my horse went down. And when he went down, I jumped the fuck off. I don't play that. And the guy's like, you wanna get back on? Nope. I'm good. My last day at the Little French Key, we're leaving. Our own private island. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and tell a friend. Stay tuned for part two of Rotan Honduras.